What's up guys this is physical media man back here again either for a physical media man monday video or another bonus video i got some facebook marketplace pickups or not facebook facebook group pickups that were shipped to me um, as well as a walmart purchase and a donation um, from friend and viewers adam and ally um, i've cleaned those up they're all ready to go on the clamshell case so uh, before I get started, make sure to like, subscribe, comment, leave feedback, do all, all that good stuff down below. I'll leave the links to my Instagram page, my Physical Media Man store Instagram page, my Facebook page for the Physical Media Man slash Physical Media Man store, my Facebook page for non-media related items, the HodgePodge Garage, my email, my eBay, my Twitter, my Letterbox account, and my Film Aficionado account where you can follow along with my collection as well as my wish list of movies I'm after. Alright, so first up... The highlight of this video for $50, $10 a piece, I got the following titles. Um, I've done some deals with this guy in the past. Yeah, he's in some Facebook groups, I believe, is how I come across it. So, um, first up, my wife wanted this one, um, and I heard good things, so I want to check it out as well. And I enjoyed the original. So, we got Greta Gerwig's Little Woman, and this is with slip cover. So, Blu ray DVD combo, missing digital. So, Thought that was worth picking up for ten dollars. I'm looking forward to, to watching that one. Next up um, was my favorite movie of the year so far, which there haven't been too many. Uh, Guy Ritchie's The Gentleman, with Matthew McConaughey, Charlie Hunnam, uh, Colin Farrell, and Hugh Grant, and some other people. Really enjoyed this movie. Um, definitely re recommend checking it out. So happy to add it to collection for ten bucks. Uh, Another one I was excited to add, um, I feel like it might be hard to get at some point, I don't know if that's true or not, but we got Jojo Rabbit, directed by, um, I can't say his name properly, I'm going to attempt, anyways, very good film, definitely recommend it, I'm so happy to add that, this is just the Blu-ray, um, digital, so digital's missing, Taiki, why, why, can, why can I not say that? I don't know. And then we got two 4Ks. Um, one I haven't seen. We got Superman Red Sun. Um, everybody's ranting and raving about this one. Um, some people I don't think liked it as much as others. But um, the premise sounded very good. So I wanted to check it out. So for 10 bucks, I'm definitely happy to add that. And then also watched this one last year and really enjoyed it. Thought it definitely needed to be picked up in 4K. We got 1917. A very good war film so um, so yeah very happy to have that in 4k so um, definitely quality over quantity here I've seen three of the five so and really enjoyed all three of those oh we got a couple big lots pickups too so for my best picture winter collection which I've decided to I was getting them all on DVD until a certain point, and then switching to Blu-ray now, I just want to get them all on Blu-ray. So we got Lord of the Rings, Return of the King for $3.95, and it sounds like a disc is loose. Um, but anyways, I uh, picked this up. Um, I enjoyed those movies when I watched them. It's been a long, long time because they're so long. Wouldn't mind revisiting at some point, but picked that up for the Best Picture Winner Collection. And I also picked this up from Dollar General, which I don't know if I said it was Dollar General. Yeah, Dollar General for that and this one. Uh, this is a double feature of Grumpy Old Men and Grumpier Old Men for $3.95. So my DVDs will be for sale. These movies are hilarious. Star, star Jack Lemmon and Walter Matthau and Anne Margaret. Uh, very good movies. Uh... Next up, I got two Walmart pickups. First up, for five bucks, we got Sylvester Stallone and Lockup. Uh, had this on the double feature with Universal Soldier, so that'll be for sale. Um, don't really know too much about it. Obviously, he's in a prison. But went ahead and grabbed it for five bucks. And then Movie Edge told me about this one, and 
I showed my wife when we were at Walmart and she was interested, so I went ahead and grabbed it. We got Girls Just Want to Have Fun with Sarah Jessica Parker and Helen Hunt. And Shannon Doherty. So it says, Janie is a shy good girl. Lynn is a cool rock chick. But when the two friends scheme to get Janie on television's biggest after school dance show, they find themselves on a wild adventure filled with cute boys, hot dancing, prudish nuns, mean rich kids, parents that just don't understand, and girls doing what they know best, just having fun. Sounds fun. Um, and it's got the cool retro VHS slip cover. Um, looks like it was put out by R. RLJE Films. Um, and lastly, we got four VHS clamshells from friends and viewers, Adam and Allie. I've cleaned these up. They're all ready to go on the clamshell shelf over to there. Um, so yeah, you can kind of see I cleaned them up. They look pretty good now. So first up, we got Michael Keaton and Jack Frost. Next up, we got Sleeping Beauty, and this is the Walt Disney's Masterpiece edition. Um, apparently, it includes approximately 15 minutes of bonus programming, plus a special commemorative booklet, which is no longer in here. But anyways, didn't have that one, surprisingly. I had a lot of the, the main ones growing up. Uh, excited about these last two. We got Hercules and the Iron Giant, which you don't see very often, I don't feel like. Uh, so, happy to be able to put those on the, the um, clamshell shelf over there. So, hope you guys enjoyed this. If you haven't yet done so, please make sure to subscribe. So, this is Physical Media Man signing off. Physical Media will never die. Physical media man, physical media man, physical media man, yeah!